Greetings and salutations, inmates. Tarl the Mad here. Glad you could join me for another episode of My Sky Factory. Yay! Yay! <laughs> A little late. Okay. Let's see. Um, I've been working. A little bit. Uh, hey, look. You can see Mandy's Island from here pretty good. Um, we've got some new neighbors. There's one down over that way. Here. Let me put my helmet back on. And... Well, look. Uh, there's Mandy's place. Go ahead and fly. Seeing how you know worked so hard to get this armor. Alright. Uh, we've had an influx of players, which is a good thing. But, uh... Some of them have been rude, so I've been forced to accelerate my program um, because it was taking too long to do it legit. Uh, I had two sides, almost two complete sides done. And you see, yeah, I'm putting mana glass in because I like the look of it, including here on the bottom. Uh, get my island a little bit to spawn in. Uh, I need to defrag my hard drive or something. I, my computer's been kind of laggy the last few days. So, but I had to resort uh, to using creative mode, which I figured out a way to pay that back so that I don't feel like it's uh, quite as bad having to use it. Um, I was playing on the island earlier today, and someone decided to come flying onto my island while I was working on making mana glass. And they started stealing all my glass and mana glass, because you have to drop the glass into these mana pools. And I'm using a funky setup here to drop these blaze rods into these endo flames because they take uh, burnable objects to create mana so that's why I've got this funky setup here going on um, found it online um, in a video seems to work pretty good I forget who it was but uh, in about two and a half days I got two or one and three quarters one and a half sides done plus uh, about half of my bottom I haven't started on my ceiling yet as you can tell so I figured out exactly how many blocks it would take and that many blocks will fill this many diamond chests it's actually 16 and like a third there's um, I figured it out it was like 1,000, 1,762.03125 stacks of uh, glass turned into mana is what would fully enclose my island on the walls. Um, so I went ahead and used creative, but I will be going through and turning all this glass. So yeah, I've started to fill it up. I haven't done much yet today because of uh, some other stuff, you know, real life stuff. So um, I've started doing that. Um, I know I was going to go to the nether and start that stuff and, and goof off over there, but uh, this has become more prevalent. I'm getting more and more people visiting my island without asking, which is not very polite. You don't just go flying around other people's islands, you know. Uh, if I do it, it's because I'm staff and I'm checking out some things off in, let's see, I believe that direction. More towards Mandy's, yeah, past Mandy's, uh, Mama Mandy's island. There's one that seems to be in a corrupted chunk, which I have to check later to see if our dev crew fixed it. But see, I got a new neighbor there. That guy hasn't been back for a while. Got one out there. You can see the dirt block. And then there's one out there next to Mandy now. So that's what I've been working on. Whee! 
Um, I've also determined, I was trying to, oh, I put it back in my system. I was going to make a wireless access point for my ME because, uh, well, frankly, it, it stinks to have to go uh, um, from all the way up top where I have a Batania garden all the way down to where my uh, um, ME access system is. So I was trying to integrate some wireless and I've run into a slight problem. The wireless access point is not enough to cover my entire island. Let's see, Let's see, right there on the top. That's a wireless access point. Then I went ahead and added wireless boosters, which gives me a range of 80 meters or 80 blocks, which goes up to right about height 200 and down to about 140. 130 if I uh, I was testing with it let's see um, see I've got my wireless terminal right here it's all charged up and everything and linked and so what I was figuring out I was gonna do I was gonna take some uh, ME wireless access points and um, with uh, extenders I was gonna put them probably have to put three of them but I was going to put like one way up there, way down there, and then right about in the middle in all four corners. And then um, maybe possibly do the same thing with this, depending on my coverage. So, um, as you may see, I've been doing a little bit of uh, colorization decorating. Um, I figured out how to make anti-blocks, which are pretty cool. They kind of give off the light. and real bright uh, of course you know uh, I like purple I use it a lot <laughs> um, I was using black there on the borders but you couldn't see them in the dark um, especially if you're down there at base level and then to just kind of break up the colors uh, I've got the uh, the green I think that's green let me get up here to uh, break it up. Is that what that is? Anti-block... No, line. So, there in the bottom, I've got it doing an X pattern, and then up here, I've got it doing a plus pattern. Um, I had needed uh, um, rain to fall. These are where my four buckets are for my witch water and uh, making my mossy cobble. And of course, these are my water elevators, which I th think um, I'm going to alter them a little bit, but um, they're going to stop being my main mode. I'm going to make some elevators, some real elevators. And what I figured out that I need to do, because everything is going on, I'm going to have to completely enclose the top of my island too, which is what I'll start doing. Um, so those will go bye-bye. And which means this will go bye-bye, which I will do later off camera. Um, I changed up my uh, crazy nether portal a little bit. I kind of like those blocks there, and then I put one there in the very middle. Of course, as you saw, I did a set home to the nether. So that's basically what I've been doing. Um, I hadn't really had a project planned out for today. Well, I kind of did, but everything going on, it kind of... My brain got fried. Unfortunately, I had, I've had to be in a couple of people again. Um, kind of leads back to my soapbox ep episode from like a week ago or so. As soon as I get done doing this, uh, I'm going to show everybody something. You know, uh, this is always a work in progress. And uh, there we go. This is our most recent, you know, no griefing, no stealing, no exploiting glitches. 
uh, which includes duping and extra mo mods, unless they're for a cosmetic reason. Um, caught somebody using an x-ray mod. You know, x-ray on Sky Factory? Why? And then, you know, other glitches. We found that Tinker's Construct has a glitch that bypasses the no PvP protection, so people were taking advantage of it, turned into big huge arguments, <sighs> led to bans. Hopefully when their bans are up and they come back, this is a no PvP server. It's always been stated we didn't think we had to put it in the rules, but we had to. So now number seven, no PvP. No AFK machines. That includes using keyboard and macro shortcuts. Yes, I busted somebody doing that. Um, timed, went back, checked server logs and everything. They were using that every two minutes. Only a macro can do that. Brilliant. No lag machines. Thankfully, we haven't found any of those. And then we go into our no chat violations, which we've had to change. Of course, you know, your standard racial derogatory slurs, your swearing, your spam, repetition, cap spam. Um, I'm going to skip this for a moment. Uh, asking staff for items. Uh, it's one thing to ask them if they want to trade. It's another thing asking them to spawn or change things. Haven't had to deal with asking to be staff, attempting to bypass chat filter. That includes abbreviations. You know, using uh, WT and then um, instead of using WTW for what the what, they use WT and then the bad word that starts with F. You know, that kinds of things. Not cool. Uh, using asterisks instead, again, not cool. Sharing a personal information. That hasn't been so big of a deal, but yeah. This one right here we actually had to add. Talking in languages other than English. It's not that we don't appreciate our our um, players from other countries. We do. We want you guys to come play. But because almost everybody that plays on the server understands English in open chat, please stay with English. And the reason why this was brought about was because one of the people that was causing problems with uh, exploiting a glitch in order to grief and PvP, they started breaking the racial and derogatory slurs and swearing rules by speaking in German or Dutch. I'm not sure which. I'm not very conversant with either language. Either way, not cool. And this all led back to this right here. Rule 6D. Arguing with staff. Okay. Mr. Magoo, or Magoo13, as I know him, is the owner of the server. He runs it. He has asked me and Mandy to be admins, and then he has asked Rogue, who you just saw log in a little bit ago, which, you know, might as well say hi. Um, Rogue and now uh, PC, who he's got a bunch of uh, uh, numbers after his name, I always forget what they are. Magoo's asked all of us to be staff in one way, shape, form, or another. And <laughs> uh, <laughs> but uh, he's asked us all to be staff. Uh, this is all volunteer basis. None of us are getting money. None of us like to have to discipline people unless it's absolutely necessary. You know, we're on here to be players also. So, you know, when we ask you to stop something, for whatever reason, we feel you're violating a rule. So, please, please stop. 
don't argue don't say but or what if or no that's arguing you know not cool um, my parents didn't put up with that when I was a kid you know I broke a rule I broke a rule no arguing no getting out of it nothing like well we both agreed to PvP uh, no this is a no PvP server but we agreed to it doesn't matter there's a rule I'm staff don't argue with me about it oh well, it's an abbreviation I could be using fridge instead of the bad word doesn't matter it's not what you intend if you intend it to be what the fridge then actually type out what the fridge not WT bad word initial no that doesn't go because there are kids on this and almost all of them know that the original definition of that particular abbreviation is to be a swear word not cool you know I ain't having to keep saying this stuff I'm not having fun this whole point of all this is to be fun you know I'm sure the few subscribers and, and views that I get are getting tired of hearing about me complain about this kind of stuff you know it, it gets it gets to be an issue I don't like issues you know <sighs> it's that's the wrong button oh I found um completely random okay I'm, I'm gonna stop the whole little thing now everybody knows I don't want to have to do it again suffice to say if you watch my videos and you're a player on the server and you follow the rules thank you if you don't follow all the rules I'm going to start being a little more strict you know I, I give people a lot of leeway because it's a new server you got to get used to the new rules being on a different server than what you're used to you know uh, than other ones you play on and all that I try to understand you know try to be a nice guy but start and take advantage of it not cool and yes I know I keep falling off good thing I have this flying armor otherwise I would have been dead wouldn't have fallen into the void I would have went curse flat I've got a floor down there now so what my projects from here on out going on for my island I'm gonna finish sealing it all off a lot of this I'm gonna be doing off camera um, the chests I will finish filling up with glass and then I will show you guys uh, updates as I go um, as I fill them up and then I will start turning them into mana glass and putting them back in the chests after I'm done um, sealing off my island so lots of fun it could take me a while um, I'm going to be working on another project also um, to get my wireless like I was saying I really want to uh, because uh, top layer I'm, I'm still off I really want to put right oh darn I can't do it okay let's see what our box oh essentially right here I want to put the uh, wireless node ooh crud I just thought of something actually I could put it right here I don't think anybody can get past one of those here let me I keep my no of course I didn't keep the wireless so let's do a little experiment I know the wireless points are supposed to be whoa my spacebar didn't want to work there for a moment all right um the wireless nodes are supposed to be part of a 
a multi-block thing. Let's see. Emmy, does that bring up my cables? Okay, we got one of those. One of those. What I'm going to do so that I uh, keep my um, looks is I can turn these anti-blocks into cable facades. So, um, depending on what's, you know, uh, this ME Smart Cable. Let's see. Um, well, that's not exactly how I want to place it, but yeah. Okay, here. Turn off. Can you? Oh, good. That's awesome. Because it's inside my my system. Do, 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 do. Uh, or inside my island. And will oh come on, let me let me out. There we go. Let's see, did that attach? I think that will attach. So if it attaches that way. Oh, oh, no, no. I can't get that. Crud circles and a half, I lost it. Thought I had my magnet turned on. Uh, it's a long time back. But what I'm going to take it is this anti block here. It's going to become a, uh, a pillar smart cable. Oh, I forgot how. From bedrock to build height. I really wish I had the draconic armor done yet because you can increase its, its height. But. So, basically I'm going to have it set up so that it goes down this pillar, it's going to be a dense cable, and then, well, actually, I'm going to be more like this. This will be the, the dense cable, and then I'll have a smart cable here come off for the wireless which just like that and then I'll use cable facade to cover this up so it looks like just the wireless access point is sticking out the edge but the thing is I've got to Um, you know, set it all up and everything. I was going to use a peer-to-peer, um, -peer, but I forget how to do it. I was trying to uh, load up my um, old Sky Factory. That's uh, I have a download of it uh, from the uh, whitelist in server. And uh, it doesn't want to load for some reason. I don't know what the deal is. Um, I even tried pulling out the the piece from a um, um, zip file of it, not just one that I've loaded recently. So yeah, it's broke. Which means instead of looking at my old peer-to-peer -peer system I had set up, I'm gonna have to uh, go back and uh, rewatch the videos. Um, I believe it was Direwolf. No, it wasn't Direwolf. It was um, someone else that explained the peer-to-peer. Uh, -peer. I watched their video for it. It was quite informative. 
So that's what I'm gonna do. I know not as much fun as I would like. That's a shame. Um, let's see. Um, I'm gonna work on uh, talking to the uh, other members of, of staff and uh, make sure. I want to make sure and get their their permission because you know they're not all on 1 a.m. But I want to get their permission, and I'm gonna see about. Uh, um, see if it's cool if I go ahead and feature their islands in a video just for spits and giggles. Um, I know Magoo's got his stuff, you know, he's got his island, uh, and I think uh, he's going to be doing a series eventually. So I'll let him do well. I'll see. I'll talk to him. We'll find out. We'll do Mama Mandy's. Um, go by Rogues. Although I think he just recently reset it, which is a shame because he had a really cool one going on. So. Let's see. Aha! And it's already color blue. Oh. I should probably go ahead and grab glass too while I'm at it, eh? It's really weird. All this rain is making me feel cold. And like I have to use the restroom. And it's not even real rain. It's like, what the heck? And that sound keeps coming out. That's funny. I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. Eee, come on, up, up, up. Yeah, I seriously need a faster way up here. So that's what I'm going to be working on. Um, I've only got... I think I've got like three series going on right now. i got two um, Xbox and this one. I really need to... Eh. I'll do some mana this time. Um, I really need to step that up. Shift and your drop key. I've changed mine to T. I know it's normally Q, but that will cause everything in your inventory to drop. The same as if you grabbed it and then hit shift and then did that. I'll turn that off because I need to see this what I'm doing. The problem is, is I can't get these open crates or anything to slow down any more than this. I found some options online, but they all require other mods that aren't part of this pack, so... Crud. Woo, that was loud. I made these hydrangeas. They're supposed to be passive and then get water from here, and then when it rains on them, they're supposed to get even more. But they seem to be doing okay. What I'm really getting a lot from is these endo flames. Ooh, excuse me, I apologize for that. But the problem is, is keeping them supplied with fuel. But I've got these blaze rods, which I can make because I got the the blaze seeds down there at my farm. So yeah, that's all good. Pink. There we go. And just throw it down like that, get a little bit of mana in there. And, just... and uh, I've already used all the black lotuses that I'd picked up from loot bags. I uh, still don't have my uh, ME system set up. Whoa, I don't want to throw that. Give it back. Still don't have my ME system set up with all the hard drives I want yet. So. Alright. Well. Ta da! See? I'll fill it up some. 
me get one more stack. Like that. And I'll finish off this. That should be enough to finish this corner. This section. Yeah, I just... I don't know, there's something about... Adding the colors and... And of course, I don't like regular glass. Yeah, I got plenty of it. But... The problem with it is, is uh, it's got a border. It's not seamless like this mana glass. And if I want a seam or a border, then, oh man, I ran out. That's probably three more. You know, if I want a seam, then I'll add colors like that. So... Well, looking at my timer, I'm reaching that time. Let's see, what homes do I have? Let's go ahead and go. Do, 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 do. Okay. Aw, oh, man. This out here. Oh, crud. Well, so much for me doing neither stuff. Kid's way too close to me. Delightful. Alright, that's fine. I'll just find a place way out in the middle of nowhere. And then I'll set a new home. I laid all this. It's all mine. I'm taking it. Okay. Oh, oh. Turn this off. Flight is such a wonderful thing. Alright. And for some. Whoa! There's one of the big spiders. Yep, it can get me up there. Oh, no, it just fell off. And that works too. Not fall to its death, I'm just coming up here long enough to go. Like that. Alright, um, plans. Next video, I will go back to the nether. I will use it as my starting point. And I will go way out in the middle of nowhere. And that's where we'll uh, start our own nether island platform for stuff. So, with all that, I'm gonna say thanks for joining me again. Oh no, I don't wanna hit you with a sword. I just wanna wave. Hi. Here, let's not break my flowers. So I wanna say thank you for joining me again. This is Tarl the Man. And remember, Minecraft. Yes, Minecraft is just a game. So have fun, build big, but behave. With that, I'll say bye.